we all knew this day was coming especially after the Leeds game and yeah is where it is farewell Mamo Lanzini Mamo Lanzini joined in the 15-16 season initially on loan until we made it permanent in the last season at the Berlin uh, was a London derby man whether it was against Chelsea Tottenham Crystal Palace etc um, originally number 28 changed to the number 10 obviously the number 10 is going to be free now um, had a mad injury that Probably stopped him from a, like a big move to Liverpool to be Coutinho's replacement. That was what was touted out at the time. And uh, yeah, uh, what what a send off to be a European champion and to have your last uh, your your last goal for West Ham be on your last game for West Ham at the last home game. Um. Uh, of the season, and uh, yeah, I'm I'm gutted. Uh, there was a point where I thought in the 2021 season when we played West Brom facing Sam Allardyce's team at home, he played the game and he was awful, and I was like, nah, this guy's done. And he scored the Tottenham goal, but this guy was done. That's what I was thinking at the time. And then we faced Burnley like right at the back end of the season. We had Rice and Mark Noble injured, so we we're struggling for centre midfielders. Who was going to play alongside Suchek? Maybe it was going to be four nows, but it was uh, Lanzini in the end. And uh, we played really well in a deeper position. And then he got injured and we had to adjust again. Lanzini scored some amazing goals for for us. Goal against Tottenham. The goal at Stamford Bridge. Uh, goal against... Uh, a goal, goal at Sellers Park. Uh, last year where he... Drives with the ball a little bit and then just flick, uh, flicks it up, keep it up, bang. Top top corner and uh, by the roof of the net. And I'm gutted. This guy was a big game player for us. He tried a lot. Uh, was in the played in the Leon game and the Sevilla game. I'm pretty sure because Bowen was injured. So yeah, he played in the Sevilla game. Uh, played in the Leon game, played played in, in, even in the Frankfurt games where we lost. Um, it was a crucial part of the back end of last season, crucial part of his first season, and we never really had. We never really built on a team around him at the time, and we should have when Payet left. Um, but yeah. Farewell, man. Farewell, Manuel Lanzini. Hopefully he goes to River Plate. I do not want to see him in another Premier League team shirt. I don't want to see him play for like Aston Villa or something. I don't want to see that. Um, so Always welcome back. Cult hero, probably. And, uh, yeah, it's, it, it could have been a better time, but at the end, it, it wasn't so bad. It wasn't so bad. So, a little short video. Uh, farewell to my boy Lanzini. Uh, if you guys did like the video, leave a like on the video and subscribe. Show you social media is in the description. If you want to follow me on the email for the inquiries, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.